Welcome to Global Current, please subscribe and hit the bell icon for more breaking updates. Hello Space Explorers! Today we dive into the incredible journey of Voyager 2. Launched in 1977, Voyager 2 is humanity's farthest traveled robot, sent to explore Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. It was our first chance to see these distant worlds up close, using a rare planetary alignment that happens only once every 176 years. This alignment let Voyager 2 use Gravity Assists, a cosmic slingshot, to visit all four giants in one mission. Voyager 2 wasn't just a scientific probe, it was an ambassador carrying the golden record, a time capsule of Earth's sights, sounds, and greetings in 55 languages, the hope, if intelligent life ever finds it, they'll know who we are. Built before smartphones or the internet, Voyager 2's technology seems ancient, yet it's still sending data after more than four decades. It's a testament to human curiosity and ingenuity, a pioneer mapping the unknown. Its mission, study the atmospheres, magnetic fields, and moons of the gas giants, turning fuzzy telescope dots into real worlds. Voyager 2's journey is a story of exploration, hope, and the human spirit reaching for the stars. Even today, August 30th, 2025, it sails silently through interstellar space. Think of Voyager 2 not just as a machine, but as a symbol of our desire to connect with the universe. Its legacy is both scientific and deeply human. Let's follow its path across the solar system and beyond. Voyager 2's mission was possible thanks to a rare planetary alignment in the late 1970s. This grand tour let one spacecraft visit Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune in a single journey a chance that comes once every 176 years. Before Voyager, we knew little about these planets, just blurry images and guesses. Voyager 2's instruments, cameras, spectrometers, and magnetometers turned distant points of light into real complex worlds. The mission inspired millions making space exploration a shared adventure. NASA's engineers had to calculate Voyager's path with incredible precision. A tiny error could mean missing a planet by millions of kilometers. The spacecraft had to survive decades in deep space facing extreme cold, radiation, and isolation. Voyager 2 was a gamble on technology and human ingenuity, and it paid off spectacularly. Its success changed how we explore the solar system. The grand tour became a symbol of what's possible when we seize a cosmic opportunity. Voyager 2's first stop was Jupiter in 1979, revealing a world of violent storms and the massive Great Red Spot. It discovered active volcanoes on Io proof that moons could be geologically alive. Using Jupiter's gravity, Voyager 2 slingshotted to Saturn, arriving in 1981. Saturn's rings, once thought solid, were revealed as thousands of intricate ringlets. The probe studied Titan's thick, hazy atmosphere, sparking decades of curiosity. These flybys revolutionized our understanding of gas giants and their moons. Voyager 2's data laid the foundation for future missions like Galileo and Cassini. Each encounter was a race against time, with the spacecraft operating autonomously millions of kilometers from Earth. For scientists and the public, it was a thrilling, real-time unveiling of alien worlds. After Saturn, Voyager 2 journeyed to Uranus, arriving in 1986, the only spacecraft ever to visit this tilted, mysterious planet. It discovered 10 new moons, 2 new rings, and a bizarre, off-center magnetic field. Uranus appeared eerily featureless, but its moon, Miranda stunned scientists with its jumbled, canyon-riddled surface. These findings challenged our ideas about how moons form and evolve. In 1989, Voyager 2 reached Neptune, revealing a world of fierce storms and the fastest winds in the solar system. It discovered the Great Dark Spot and confirmed Neptune's faint rings and six new moons. The flyby of Triton, Neptune's largest moon, revealed icy geysers erupting from its frozen surface, evidence of active geology even at the solar system's edge. These encounters showed the outer planets were full of surprises and diversity. Voyager 2's discoveries at Uranus and Neptune were a spectacular finale to the Grand Tour. The mission proved that even the most distant worlds are dynamic and complex. Each flyby expanded our understanding of the solar system's outer reaches. Voyager 2 opened our eyes to the wonders at the edge of our cosmic backyard, its legacy revealing the unknown, one planet at a time. After Neptune, Voyager 2's mission shifted to the Voyager Interstellar mission, heading beyond the Sun's influence. In 2018, after 41 years, it crossed the heliopause, entering interstellar space. Voyager 2's instruments detected a sharp boundary where the solar wind meets the interstellar wind, a wall of plasma. 
It measured a dramatic rise in cosmic rays and found the interstellar magnetic field was stronger and more organized than expected. These discoveries changed our understanding of how our solar system interacts with the galaxy. The data, graphs of plasma, magnetic fields, and cosmic rays are snapshots of a realm no human-made object had ever reached. Though not traditional photos, these measurements are Voyager 2's most profound messages. They reveal what lies beyond the sun's protective bubble. Voyager 2 is sending back the first direct evidence of the universe outside our solar system. Its journey continues to redefine the boundaries of exploration. Communicating with Voyager 2, now over 20 billion kilometers away, is a marvel of engineering. Radio signals take over 18 hours to reach it, so every command is a day and a half round trip. The Deep Space Network's giant antennas in California, Spain, and Australia pick up Voyager's faint signals, 20 billion times weaker than a watch battery. The spacecraft's high-gain antenna must stay precisely aimed at Earth, requiring careful adjustments from mission control. In 2020 when the main Australian antenna was offline we could only listen not talk, yet Voyager 2 kept working flawlessly. Its power comes from a nuclear battery, the RTG, which has kept it running for over 45 years. As power dwindles engineers have turned off instruments to keep the mission alive. Every bit of data is precious, squeezed from a machine built in the 1970s. Voyager 2's resilience is a tribute to its design and the people who keep it going. Even at the edge of the solar system, we're still in touch with our distant explorer. The mission is a masterclass in patience, precision, and perseverance. Voyager 2 is more than a spacecraft. It's a symbol of human achievement and curiosity. It transformed four distant dots into vibrant, complex worlds, inspiring generations of scientists and dreamers. Its discoveries, volcanic moons, supersonic winds, icy geysers, reshaped planetary science, the mission proved deep space exploration is possible, influencing every probe that followed. The golden record it carries is a message of hope, a greeting to the cosmos. Voyager 2's images and data have become part of our collective imagination. Its journey reminds us that exploration is at the heart of who we are. Now sailing through interstellar space it will outlast us, carrying our story into the galaxy. Its faint signal is a whisper from Earth to the stars. Voyager 2 challenges us to keep exploring, to ask new questions and to reach further. Its legacy endures, a testament to the power of curiosity and the human spirit.